Hello everyone, we'd love to welcome you to our UTMB Pathology program and today we're going to give you a tour of our UTMB Galveston Hospital. We're going to begin our tour at the main entrance of the hospital, which leads in right into the main lobby. And here is coffee shop number one. It also has a quick bite available to eat. And the first stop of our tour will be the hospital cafeteria. So each week they will release a menu which will tell you the daily options they'll have at the hot bar and you have your cafeteria basics that are available every day. A few popular places are the Chick-fil-A and then we also have the grill, sushi, salad and other snacks as well too. And here's the second coffee shop, the Starbucks that's in the hospital. And while we're in this area, this is our library where we take our service exams and also a couple research buildings as well. Here we have the trademark of UTMB Galveston. It is our building nicknamed Old Red, and this is where we take our yearly resident photo as well. main entrance and first we're going to go to the fifth floor which is where majority of our residents are at. So here is our resident area in the pathology department. We have some memorabilia, very important people, part of our program. And here we have some resident publications and some posters that they presented. And so this is our resident room and here you'll see the residents uh, meeting up right before going to lecture, cleaning up their lunch, catching up with each other. And each resident is given their desk at the beginning of the year so you can decorate it however you want. And we also have a kitchenette so you can have all your coffee and fridges and microwaves without you leaving the resident room. And then this is one of our first sign-out rooms, so this is going to be cytology. Typically our sign-out rooms have multi-headed scopes and they're connected to screens and computers so you could have access to patient information while you're looking at slides, which makes it really easy to sign out with faculty and share information super, super easily. Here's our autopsy sign-out room, which has a similar setup. And the cool thing is, is that we also have WHO access to the program every year. And here's one of our smaller conference rooms that people can study or meet with attendings in. 
and here's one of the larger rooms and for example this one's used specifically for DMTs and here's our printer and school supplies. This is a larger break room with tables, TV. We do have soft pebble ice, so that's super great. And every day at noon, we have protected didactic time. So this is where you, your only responsibility is to eat your lunch and watch the lecture. And lectures are a mix of at APCP attendings, grand rounds, wellness, and some resident lectures as well. Now we're gonna head down to floor number four. And this is gonna be our search path room. So this is gonna be our gross area as well as our search path sign up area. And again, more multi-headed scopes connected to screens. And here's some physical slides that we were taking a look at that day. And so we are 100% digital in search path. So each setup has really good monitors that are approved. coffee as well so you don't have to leave the search path sign out room to get your fix and here we have the digital scanners and we have a really great support staff that helps us bund the scanners organize our slides put them in storage so that's really great to have as a resident This is our frozen grow station and our cryostats. And here's one of our first year residents performing a frozen. The cool thing is, is that starting on your very first rotation, you do get to have experience with doing frozen. So by the time it's your fourth year, you're ready to go and super comfortable. Here's our grossing stations, and we have dedicated gross time starting at 3 p.m. every day. Here's our histo lab, so again, everything's really close if needed. And then right across, we have our cyto lab. And here's the buckets we take with us on roses. And here's a resident digital scanner. And every day at 1.15, we have interesting case conference. So it's really fun to grab a coffee, grab your tea, and look at cases together with attendings. And residents can also bring their cases as well. And this is how search path sign up typically looks like one-on-one -on -one with your attending. All right, and our last stop is up to the seventh floor to visit Himpa. And here's the flow cytometry lab right next door. And here you have some of our other automated machines. These are used in chemistry, urine analysis, CBCs. All right, thank you guys for joining us today and we hope to see you soon.